Hey Battlefront players and welcome to the Mod Showcase, where we bring you the latest and greatest mods created by the Battlefront community. Each video will be looking at the top 5 most recent best quality mods, which not only impress visually, but as well push the game's modding possibilities to its limit. You ready? Let's go! So we're gonna start off with this beauty of a mod by Sub. It's a simple, yet very effective mod that actually corrects an issue within the game that I've been complaining about since, uh, day one. And that, people, is the proper cannon rocket trooper skin for the Empire. Because, come on, if we're being honest with ourselves, this right here just won't do. Playing with the Imperial Rocket Trooper with this mod feels great, and it's a shame that it really took somebody from the modding community to really fix DICE's oversight. It's funny, as I was actually going to create a mod exactly like this myself until a viewer of the channel brought this mod to my attention. So thanks for that, as no need to get my modding hands dirty anymore. Unfortunately, due to modding limitations, all we're missing now from making this mod perfect is to get the oxygen tubes attached to the jetpack instead of the chest piece. But whatever, as this mod is already a step in the right direction nonetheless in my opinion. Any Luke Skywalker fans in the house? This one by Lame Streamer actually sees the addition of Luke's rebel uniform at the end of A New Hope. This is actually something I didn't think I wanted in the game originally. Well, until I saw this mod and that changed my mind completely. Sure, the yellow could be a big giveaway in online multiplayer, but just looking how slick Luke looks like in this mod is enough to convince me that I actually want it in the actual game. Alongside a younger version of his face to boot. It's a trap! Because Admiral Akbar could now be playable in your copy of Star Wars Battlefront 2 today thanks to Ice Dizun. This cool mod sees Akbar fight in. wait, could it be? The uniform of Admiral Radis from Rogue One? Okay. What an odd combination, but I like it. If anything, it makes this mod even more awesome. So wait, does that mean we should also be expecting a Radis head on an Akbar uniform sometime in the future then? Cause I download that too. Just saying. Big fan of Star Wars Rebels? Well, we've got you covered then. As a pretty impressive looking mod by Sorox sees the crafty Twi'lek pilot from the Ghost Crew actually make an appearance in the game. You know who we're talking about, Harris and Dula. Yeah, sure, the mod simply replaces the rebel officer of Harris and Dula rather than make her an actual hero character as she should be. But you've gotta hand it to the mod maker, the detail on this one is very on point. Going all the way to even seeing the blur reskin to Hera's custom pistol as well. I'd say all it's missing are the goggles to really make it perfect. And last but not least, on account on how absurd and outlandish this mod is, yet strangely works so well in this game, it's actually scary. Meet the Buzz Lightyear mod by Fruit by the Fet. Yeah, it's exactly as it looks, and no, your eyes are not deceiving you. It's the real deal. The detail on this mod work is absolutely stunning, and one of the best mods I've seen to date in this game. Which I never thought I'd be saying about a Buzz Lightyear mod in a Star Wars game, but here we are. And yes, you can ask yourself why this is apparently a thing, but what's the point? Embrace it! It's crazy stuff like this that makes the whole modding potential for Battlefront 2 so much more exciting. As you can see weird out of this world things that you'd never expect to see in a million years in a Star Wars game. Such as Buzz Lightyear of all people. Now after seeing this, it got me thinking on what Fruit by the Fed's next project is. Maybe Woody from Toy Story as well, because I would not be surprised at this point. But hey, look at that, you made it all the way to the end. Hopefully you enjoyed that as that will do it for this mod showcase. As always, if you enjoyed the video, please like it, share it, and subscribe to the channel to not only support it, but keep up with Star Wars news, gaming, and canon lore released every week. And consider following me on Twitter and Facebook to never miss out on the latest Star Wars related content. And if you still want to continue the conversation, then definitely join us on our official Silo Discord channel. Thanks for watching, and may the Force be with you!